The Labour Party has in the past months been battling with leadership crisis threatening to tear the party apart. Some members of the party are of the view that the tenor of the Julia Saburi led administration ended on June 3, 2024, leaving a vacuum at the leadership level. But the Aburi faction disagreed, citing an election held at a convention in Inewi, an Ambra state, on March 24, 2024, where Aburi was re-elected as chairman. However, the Independent National Electoral Commission did not monitor the convention. This may have informed the reason for this extended stakeholders meeting called by the Abia State Governor, Alex Oti, to get a new leadership in place. The party at the end of the meeting set up a 29-member caretaker committee led by Senator Nemadi Usman with Darlington Wokocha as secretary. The presidential candidate of the party in the 2023 elections, an Abia State Governor, speaks to the event. We're not here, like you said, all we're doing here is to continue the exercise of building. We're not here to dissolve, we're not here to suspend or sack anybody. We just want to do it properly. What we're doing here is just to save our party. When we found ourselves is that as of the 8th of June, 2024, this moment, that our party does not have leadership. The former Plato State Deputy Governorship candidate of the party and a senior advocate of Nigeria speaks to the communique. The political committee should put in place mechanisms to ensure that congresses are conducted at all levels of the party in the national convention when the party will have a duly constituted executive in place. The appointed committee members is a call for peace and reconciliation of the party. Stakeholders have decided to work out a different way of getting the party to work by embracing peace and bringing people together. It's quite uh, very deep because it has uh, brought total peace to the party and the direction as well. Uh, it was rather less before, but as it stands today, uh, there is leadership. A former national chairman of APGA described the March 24 convention as setting the cart before the horse. We have to do the necessary things before you move to that end. We hadn't done what congresses, we hadn't done local government congresses, we hadn't done state congresses, and now we were faced with a convention. For these stakeholders, the meeting became necessary to deal with issues affecting the party and broker peace ahead of the 2027 elections. To deliberate on the current situation of our party, um, to deliberate on some issues and hurdles that the party might face if we could not, we could not take control. The sacrifice for the development of a political party is the best interest of the general public because opposition political party play a very fundamental role in making sure that our people's interests are protected. It's quite necessary that uh, the party, an action is taken to chart a new course within the ambits of the law. A raise of sense, they had this to say. We embrace this. I believe at the level of the leadership, at the leadership level, it's also dealing with all those negotiations. This meeting may mark the beginning of a new Labour Party in Nigeria, ready to take over power in 2027. Nora Okafor, Arise News.